Galatians chapter 5 verse 16 but I say walk by the spirit and you will not gratify the desires of the flesh in the New Living Translation it says like this so I say let the Holy Spirit guide your lives then you won't be doing what your sinful nature craves amen see when you read this passage what it reminds us is that the responsibility of walking in the spirit is on our shoulders don't expect your pastor to come and spoon feed you all the time come for counsel come for mentorship but let me remind you something walking by the spirit is your responsibility wake up in the morning make that conscious decision tell God I want to walk by the spirit I want to walk by your will I want to walk according to your purpose make that decision every day it's not enough that you made once upon a time it's not enough that you committed yourself once upon a time make it every day because when you make it every day you're constantly reminded that there is a path that God has set for me and I need to walk and I can tell you when you're called for a purpose when you're called for a specific purpose the enemy also creates a path for you so that you can stray away from that purpose but when you make that commitment saying, God, I want to walk according to your will. I want to walk according to your desire. You will always stay on the right 